when doing business with foreign customers who prefer to pay in their local currency. Consider your options to manage and mitigate foreign exchange risk. From the viewpoint of a U.S. exporter, foreign exchange risk is the exposure to potential financial losses due to depreciation of the foreign currency against the U.S. dollar. For example, U.S. goods are sold to a European company for 1 million euros at an exchange rate of 1 euro to 1.25 U.S. dollars and a 60-day payment term. If the exchange rate remains the same when the payment is due, the U.S. exporter receives 1.25 million U.S. dollars. However, if the euro's value weakens to an exchange rate of 1 euro to 1.20 U.S. dollars during the 60-day payment period, the exporter receives only 1.2 million U.S. dollars, $50,000 less. Such losses can have a big impact on a U.S. company. The good news is that there are practical options to help manage foreign exchange risk to avoid potential currency losses. Option number one, the exporter negotiates a forward contract with a bank or foreign exchange service provider. If the importer is creditworthy or an established customer, this is the most direct and common method. The contract ensures the U.S. exporter will receive a predetermined payment in U.S. dollars at a future date, regardless of fluctuating exchange rates. To set up a forward contract, an exporter must know the foreign currency amount and when the importer will pay to accurately choose a currency exchange delivery date. In this follow-up example, our U.S. exporter to Europe decides to negotiate a forward contract by taking several steps. First, the exporter agrees to consider accepting the importer's payment in euros. Second, the exporter contacts the bank or foreign exchange service provider to negotiate a 60-day forward rate to lock in the exchange rate. If the rate is unacceptable, the exporter can check with other bank or service providers as terms and rates can vary. There are no standard fees for forward contracts. Next, with a forward contract commitment from the bank, the exporter and importer finalize the sales price and payment terms in the sales agreement. The exporter then enters into a forward contract with its bank to lock in the rate and commit to a delivery date to exchange the 1 million euros for US dollars. Finally, the importer pays the exporter on time. Following the forward contract terms on the delivery date, the exporter delivers the 1 million euros to its bank in exchange for US dollars. If the exporter is uncertain when the importer will pay, an alternative is to request a window forward contract with the bank or service provider. This gives the exporter a window of delivery between two dates. Option number two, the exporter accepts foreign currency payments only with cash in advance. This method is simple, ensures full payment, and is the most risk-free. It is ideal for small transactions as well as for new relationships with importers. A drawback is that cash in advance is the least desirable method of payment for importers. Option number three, match foreign currency receipts with expenditures. In this method, the exporter sets up a foreign currency bank account to conduct transactions and eliminate currency conversion fees. This is ideal for U.S. exporters that use the same foreign currency with different trading partners. Drawbacks can be the cost and effort required to maintain a foreign currency bank account and record gains and losses resulting from currency conversions in financial statements. Consult with your bank before agreeing to the importer's foreign currency payment request. Here are some questions to ask. When should an exporter consider selling in a foreign currency? How common is it for a small exporter to set prices in a foreign currency? What type of transactions are more suitable for foreign exchange? And what are the fees for using a forward contract? By taking steps to manage foreign exchange risk, U.S. companies can sell in foreign currencies and enhance their global competitiveness. For more information on trade finance options, 
visit trade.gov forward slash export solutions.